Okay. We're at Adams Air Force Base. Four shields. What's our mission? Just look at him. Okay. Is it any good? Not really, no. Is the heavy weapon or uh, it's probably energy because it does so little damage compared to the Gatling laser? No, uh, I have no idea though. This is Paladin Tristan. If you're listening to this, then you've made it through the Presidential Metro, and Adams Air Force Base is all that stands in your way. Our scouts report that the fire controls for the orbital missile satellite are located in the main tower of the Enclave mobile platform. The only way into the platform is by way of a ramp that lowers from a watch post the Enclave set up in the old air traffic control tower. When you opened the crate, it triggered a beacon. We'll pick up the signal and start the assault to cover your entry. Good luck, and Godspeed. Speed of God. So people are risking their lives as a distraction. Zero out of nine. Mm, deactivate threats. It's the likeliest thing to work, and I don't want to cause undue alarm. We'll see how far we can get. Before things turn to crap. And a goddamn crash. Uh, hopefully, this is just a random crash and not an indication of how painful this DLC is going to be. Yeah, let's try this again. Die hacked trick. Hopefully this doesn't crash often. I really really hope so. This looks like a major area, so if this crashes like only after like five minutes into the into our recording. Yeah. Watch that. More trades. I also have given a uh, Again, a little bit of more thought into maybe playing the Fallout 3 New Vegas. And I think I'll probably play it very close to like this. In, in the sense that very few modifications. And the reason is really, I want sort of a gaming experience I can compare to the other. And if I mod with one game and not the other, that's not really going to happen, is it? If they're totally incomparable. Also, want to see how much of a, how much things have changed, how much things have been fixed, altered, how much things have moved in the correct way and in the wrong way. So, so what I'm guessing is the original game with all the DLC, some minor mods to make the sh targeting like it should be and that's pretty much it let's see where it goes there what the options we have I think 
that's it's it's not a bad experience like that, and it's fair to fair to Fallout 3 and these because it's a uh, comparing game as it should be versus a game as it should be. I do want to make that comparison. I've never I played both of the games, but I've never played them. There probably has been years in between the when I played the one and then the other, so I can't really make a fair comparison between the two. I don't think I can at the moment. And I'd like to do it. Yeah, uh, we have no options but to go through here. That guy is a problem. Okay, next time when he goes to the other side, we'll try to go past. We don't have a lot of time. So move, 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 move. don't intend to play this area safely all the way through, but uh, I don't want to stumble into every obstacle we, we need that comes our way. Uh, pretty much the worst possible place. That the incinerator and the patrol should be safe on them. Yeah. Ooh. Gatling laser ammunition. A lot of Gatling laser ammunition. At least I'll try to get past the initial defenses unnoticed. Meaning sneak attack, grenade, strikes. Not exactly unnoticed that, but. Nuke grenades. Uh, yeah, I think we have to go through here. They have a, a really good defensive line there, so I don't want to trigger it. Two artillery switch. Sector 1 artillery node. From Enclave High Command, Artillery Order 447, Sector 1. Brotherhood of Steel have cleared the outer perimeter of the base. Clearance has been given to use artillery strikes on Sector 1 if and only if all other resources have been exhausted. Targets are clearly visible. Exercise extreme caution.
don't seem to be doing much to those guys. No, they are getting killed. Once the helicopter is on fire, oh birdie birdie. You always want to have an unguarded kill all our own men's bottom near base. It's, prob it's probably some kind of rule, like with self destructs uh, ability with every every spaceship ever developed. It, it's just mandatory, mandatory thing. Okay, I need to go there, but how can I go there? I can't bypass the force fields. There aren't that many people alive here though. So not too interested in looting in general. I might do it certainly from time to time, but Death Claw Pendor. Close and lock. Yeah, probably yes. I don't want this close running here. Yeah. That a death claw too. Probably is. They are friendly to us, aren't they? So we have the control thingy. Yes, they are, so why wouldn't I let them go? Ramshackle. That's a good password. What can I open? Definitely all hostile. They're not controlled death claws, that's the problem. They seem yeah, I'm using uh cellphone. Getting there a lot. A uh, minor miscalculation on my part. Now well, they might cause some problems. For the enclave. So it may not be a too big of a deal. And I managed to avoid the PC. Now that is a goddamn miracle. Although. There might be an issue with uh, sneaking being too powerful in this game. Death flow being right in front of my face didn't see me. Sure, not see you if you are using a stealth boy, but just huddling in the corner, not see you.
Okay, it seems like we're getting close to our target area. Yeah, how... Yeah, very close. What are they firing at? I don't want to know. Uh, it's probably one of the death calls. Go up. Discovered enemies air traffic control zone. Take it cool, take it cool. Hopefully he's on a patrol bras. Sniper. Question is do it drive in circles or I'm gonna go back the way it came from? I think it died. I don't get uh, yeah, I don't get experience because I uh, have full experience. Of course, of course. I wonder what kind of resistance there is here. Mobile platform control. Contact mobile platform control center. Putting around. How do we enter there? I'm guessing they're bomb bombing me. Otherwise, they, it doesn't make much sense. So how do they know I'm there? The automated defense system thingy. Oh, no. 
we needed to activate something to gain access to something. I have no idea. Enter Enclave Mobile Platform. Yeah, I noticed that those look awfully lot like tracks. How do we... There should be a loading ramp now open. This is Paladin Tristan. If you're listening to this, then you've made it through the Presidential Metro, and Adams Air Force Base is all that stands in your way. Our scouts report that the fire controls for the orbital missile satellite are located in the main tower of the Enclave mobile platform. The only way into the platform is by way of a ramp that lowers from a watch post the Enclave set up in the old air traffic control tower. When you opened the crate, it triggered a beacon. We'll pick up the signal and start the assault to cover your entry. Good luck, and Godspeed. And zero damage. It was a hit, basically, but zero damage. I love this. Impact imminent! Ooh. Automated heavy incinerator turrets. Whoops. What the fuck did you do? Sneaky time was over there for a moment. Could have easily be avoided with stealth point. Probably should have. Mobile base crawler. Pulsion field control. Turn off, set time to charge. Schmass, yeah, turn off. Science 80. A high security clearance. Robots destroyed here. Why aren't they using them against me? That's something I don't really get. Are they just non functional for other reasons? Oh man, don't hurt me. I just work here. What are you doing down here? I uh, work on the robots, I fix them up. I saw what you did before you got in the base. You're not gonna hurt me, are you? I wasn't planning on it. Oh, thank goodness. I'm Stiggs. Nice to meet you. Could you answer some questions? Man, I'm glad you realize I'm not one of the bad guys. 
I'll be happy to answer any questions you have. What type of defenses are upstairs? Well, just above us is a Death Claw research facility. Most of the Death Claws are out fighting, but there might be one or two left. There are also a bunch of robots in the facility, and they're all controlled through the mainframe. There are also some military types left, but not nearly as many as there used to be. Robotics expert dialogue. Wow, are all the robot, all of the robots are run of uh, V31 fame mainframe. Huh. It's nice to finally meet someone who knows what the heck I'm talking about. It's actually a modified version of the V29, but response recall protocol is improved, and the data transfer is much more secure. If you got into the mainframe, you could control all of the robots in the facility. Rexic, where exactly is it? Well, you'll want to get to the floor above and then make your way to the middle. That's where the mainframe is. Hmm. Satellite tower. Well, the satellite tower is right on top of the base. I'm sure you saw it before you came in. You're going to have to make it to the central control area before you can get on top of the launch platform. Once you're on top of the platform, you're probably going to have to make your way past a bunch of soldiers before you get to the tower. Yeah, I have to go now. Yeah, see you. I don't mind if he turns hostile. It won't make any difference. Nothing really useful. A lot of uh, medical supplies. Okay, now we have, presumably, a correct view of the general structure of the ship. We're mainly interested in the quantum. Look at the quantum. We have turbine time, like so. Bombs. Raxo. Yeah, that should give us uh, quite a few grenades. Tin cans or. Come on, there are cans. Don't you pick. Warning, a live death cause. Please they put a warning sign there. A nice day. There are no cans here either. I guess we'll just make a few grenades, leave the rest for some other time. Not too big of a deal. I want to take a quick look what's here. Other guys. Hmm. 
Quad Sigma. Yeah, there's some kind of special enclave. Certainly have their unique weaponry. What is this? Armory. Either sure, we can repair our own. Ooh, smoke nades. Enhancement drugs, a link. Yeah, you'd never thought a crappy can would be one of the more better items to find in these. Uh, launch pan. Enclave Sigma Reed leader. This was a Sigma squad. Lovely bunch of people. Continue on. 